up everybody today i'm going to be showing you my fishing setup um first we're going to go over the rods now for first, first of all we are very sorry for not posting uploaded. lately i just haven't really had a lot to post because i haven't gone riding school. a little bit school and all that but now it's the summer so i should post a little bit more we're going on a vacation to july on july 12th and we're going to Louisiana, and we're going to saltwater fish, so I should get some content out of that. I'll just, like, do day one, day two, day threes, and day four. And five, and five, and all that, and six, and seven. But anyways, um, what we first got right here, I'm not, I'm going to get a new rod for it, because it's getting kind of small for me. I have a spinning, or not, yeah, a baitcaster, um, rod. Right now, I have... Uh, this is my lure for it. It's like a broom for bass fishing, but I don't have any hooks on it because I'm kind of practicing um, casting with it. So, um, but yeah, this is my bait caster. The um, thing itself is a Abu Garcia. Stop the filming. What? Bait casting reel. That's one of my favorites. Now this is my saltwater rod. I mean, I can use that one for saltwater too if I put a bait on there. But basically. It, I got a spinning reel, and it is a um, BG 3500 Dig-a-deer, dig, -a -deer, dig, -a -deer, dig, -a -deer, dig -a deer or air, air, ro air rotor, so still haven't got some, it's a little bit new, so haven't got some of these off still, um, but right now I got this bait on there. I don't really have to practice with this mod rod much because I know how to cast it really good. And uh, this is the bait I got. And I caught this trout with, not this bait, but with this rod. Show a picture on the screen. Yep, there you go. Um, this one. Yeah, that's my crappie rod. Wait, wait I, let's take it and let's not do the full length because, yeah. It's, this is my crappie rod. Uh, I just kind of have this reel on it because it's a little bit easier to use for this. Um, but yeah, my crappie rod. And um, now we're going to get into my baits. So let's go. Alright guys, so these are, well, most of these are um, freshwater baits. Some of them are salt water. But actually a lot of them are salt water. But um, right here we got the she dog. It's kind of like a she dog, I think. And it's this pink one. I don't know. And this one is this exact, is that exact same one, just a little bit more fat and all that. Um, that one. This one, they call these chicken on chains. Come in a lot of colors. What's that? This, oh, it's a fake shrimp, like a lure, kind of. Got a bunch of fake shrimp. Yeah, this bad boy. I still gotta put a hook through there. Um, this is a freshwater. Um, I think this is saltwater, maybe a little bit of freshwater. It's the same with this one. And this is my um a bass fishing one. Use this for bass fishing. And then these are just a bunch of hooks. Bunch of hooks with the jigs on them. And then I'll get into the next box. This one is on the one looks like yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. These are um the freshwater lures for sure. So I got this one. It's kind of just a basic. Then next one that I got it are these. They're all kind of like this. Got little hair to cover the hook up. And I got these shiny shiny um scales so like that and i got some more of those show you quite a few here uh i'll show you my favorite there you go there's my two, another one my two favorites are probably this one i like this one right here and then i also like this guy right here and then got this Just some couple of, of those, and then yeah, that basically is the salt water. Or, 
not salt water, fresh water baits that I have. Yes, yes, so that's just the kind of hookups and all that. A little bit. Oh, of, these have hooks. Yeah, they got hooks. Those got are, these, these are some these are just baits. different colors. They're like different color baits, and they got I'm stuck uh, on the carpet. Okay, these are just different color baits. Um, with there is green. There's kind of a like tannish. And then you got a stringer. A bunch of you guys probably know this. Or if you catch some fish, you don't got a cooler. Um, just tie this to whatever you got, boat, something like that, and then put a fish on there. Just put this through their gills and then ride them on there, and they'll just sit in the water for a little bit until you are ready. This is a bee hooker. Yeah, Should I, do, I think that's a bee hooker at least. Well, we think this is a D-hooker. It might not be like, like it's not you know, but what it is. Yeah, these some are just some This is mostly like a pond, kind of. Or like a stream. Well, Alright, and then these are a bunch of... Ah! These are a bunch of plastics. Uh, you gotta put hooks on them. But you got these white ones. Um, you got the red ones and... My personal favorites are either this, the, or no. I like the ones that are like this because they look like little tadpoles. This looks a lot like a tadpole. This one kind of just stands out to the fish. This one also this one does. Has a hook. And then this one is like, I like it a lot too. Which one has a hook? Oh, mm -hmm. this one? Yeah, and then there's. That's a, what they look with the. That's what um, they look like with the hook. <laughs> 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 and then like these, I'm not really gonna put a hook in there right now because I don't want to waste one. So just have to stop, dude. I'm trying. This is going on YouTube, dummy. Idiot, hey, get Bob out of here. Bob, get Bob off of me. Bob wants to be the video. He's already. All right. But this you is kind of what it looks already. like whenever you got it. I mean, it's kind of like a little tadpole. Just, just oh. look at all these with the camera. Yep. Just don't mind it. Stupid stuff. <laughs> don't use your hands. Hey, you idiot. How much more do we got? One more? Those are just kind of. And then those are just kind of some salt water uh, bobbers that you gotta use. You say you get the idea. You're annoying, Patrick. Get out of the shot. And now we can move on to um, yeah my bag. Here's one. So out here's of a, one out of my bag. This is stop, dude. God, I can't do anything without my. You don't like that, Bryson? Did you literally film that whole thing? <laughs> okay. It stopped wherever it stood right. up. All right, Bryson. So you also this is. Another kind of pink she dog. Yeah. Like this for my salt water. Once again, another she dog. Different color. Different color. Salt water. And I think this is the, um. Yeah, <laughs> 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 look like a nerd. Okay, but this is the Marilure, um. Kind of, it swims good. Um, gold bait. And this is just to hide the hook. And then this, another cool bait. There's another one. Yeah, and there's another one with the string. With these. Some cool gold baits. Here, you can put that one in there. And then if I ever need to rig one up. My next bait. These ones are just hooks. These are just weights. And then those are just weights. Put these back. Um, hold up. I'm, I'm going to go over something. So these 
big boys are obviously, I mean, you can use them in fresh water if you're like fishing real deep. These are mostly salt water um, weights. weights. And then these ones can kind of be either one. And I know for sure, unless you are fishing for croaker in the ocean, you are really not going to need this. Or, yeah. But these are mostly, these are literally kind of just fresh water for brim. Hold up. Maybe a few crappie. Maybe. Um, Which we got to put these on the bottom. Oh yeah, that's the big one. This is just another stringer. Huge stringer. Kinda for salt water or a big haul. Uh here, let's put it all out. Alright, so another thing is try to do is just put the fish on these, hook it through the gill if you can, or the mouth, wherever the heck you wanna do it. And then struggle to get it back in. And then there are a couple more of these. And then after that, it's just a bunch of lines in case you got way more than what you were expected to. But yeah. Uh, hold on, I'll roll it up. Yeah, you can get the next one out. Yeah. Anything else in your bag? Dipping glow and then some bobbers, stringers. Good. I didn't even know there was one of this. Hold up, I don't get that out. Nope. Go to the other one. The other part. No, get the one. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now this is what I call, or it's actually called it. It's some um, spike it dipping glow is very helpful to do is it's kind of for salt water or fresh water gives off a little scent that attracts fish and um it also makes so if you're fishing at night it makes it glow if you're fishing in deep waters and it's hard to see hard for hard for the fish to see boom some dipping glow um i've actually caught a fish while using it um i had a chicken on a chain i'll show you i'll show you the bait that kind of looks like it Patrick. <laughs> 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 oh, hope Julie doesn't watch this. I know. I hope you let it rip, buddy. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, your stuff started leaking. Oh god, that's not good. Get it up! It smells. Oh, it smells bad. Yep. Yeah, it smells good to fish is the sad part. Yo! Yo! Okay, it's just on the cap now. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna put the dipping glow up. Okay, pause right there. But anyways, um... The chicken on a chain is this. It's really good with this because it... Sparkles, number one. Please do not open it in the room. And then <laughs> you dip it in. It glows too. Don't dip the dip. Don't open the glow. Yeah, don't open the dipping glow in the room because it stinks. We learned that the hard way. Frederick! <laughs> <laughs> that one was wet! That was the wet part! <laughs> Over these, these are kind of just some gulps. Things. Oh no, it's broken. Oh no, it's breaking. It's breaking. Okay. 
Comes with the bait. It's really nice. Um, There's different colors. Yeah. Oh yeah, and um, more of these. A little bit of these. These have juices on. They them. got juices. Um, yeah, like Hayden said, some string. It's not the best string because it's kind of like practice string. But yes, we do have string. And then we got a bunch of more of these. like brand and crappie string. Um, more hooks. Uh, oh, that's, bobber. oh yeah, that's mine. That's mine. <laughs> Patrick! I was the viewers in here. Some more of these. Turn the volume all the way up, Grayson. And then we got these red ones that are stand out. But anyways, as I was going to say, mirror lure is an... Guys, mirror lures are awesome. You should buy some. Mirror lure. Um, if you, if you want to hit me up with that sponsor, I'd be glad. <laughs> no? Okay. <laughs> you gotta show them the best part of the bag. Yeah, I know! What part? The cover. Oh! Mm -hmm. So if it's ever raining on your bag, something. Voila! The bag cover. <laughs> And if you break it off, deal with it. And then you might be wondering, Brett Sawyer. Brett Sawyer, the back. What are you gonna do with that? Boom, baby. Dang it, we got the dipping glow on it. <laughs> yes, look, there's a little mark. Then you have to become a magician. Let's do a hang right now. I'm just playing the mobile game. That sponsors this video. Drum roll, please. Boom! Got these bad boys. Let's take a look, shall we? So, first off, right off the bat, we got some gulps. Let's Great just baits. take them all and put them on a pile. No, because I don't want to get these unsweet. Great baits to use in salt water, fresh water. With these. Serious video. Some of these. Um, Patrick's playing Coin Master. Um, some chicken on train time. If y'all have never been fishing, I'll have to try. No, I <laughs> that was a real one, Patrick. Yeah, uh, the killer baits. More of these one. bad boys. Those, these are beasts. These. Now these resemble eels, and they have juices in them, as you can see. They're eels, and then a bunch of stuff like eels. And it's made for. Let me see. It says something on them. 
like redfish, a bunch of stuff will bite this. Salt water, boom. More of these. And her. then there's some. And then you've kind of seen these in my bag already, but mirror lure. These are mirror lure. Come on, I need the sponsor. There's um, there's these for minnows, which are already hooked. And then mirror lures. Of course, you gotta have. If you are a fisherman and you do not have mirror lures, then what are you actually doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, you don't have mirror lures? No, I do not. I gotta hook you up with some mirror lures. Hayden, take these home. Share them with Grayson. Okay. You are being. Your fishing career is getting messed up without having those. Um. They are an essential for fishers. Um, you got some more. Unless you only fish for brim. Unless you only like fishing, they might even make stuff for freshwater. But you got these. Cause I don't go for um, fishing for trout, redfish, no. Well, next time them. you're at the beach. But anyways, um, some more of these. Pink boys. That's one of my favorite baits. No, I look. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love these. You eat <laughs> no, I love these. These are. These. <laughs> 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 no, these down south lures. These ones are goaded. What do you eat, Patrick? <laughs> some Cajun lures. Catch them for on for Cajun. Um, oh. these look sick. Wait, well, neither. I have not really noticed these <laughs> until today, but those. That's gonna catch a redfish right there, or a trout. Or what you like need that. to do is make sure your lures have lures have scent on them. Come let Patrick fart on them. Make them smell. I know, perfect. perfect. Um, now, uh, I actually got these at a Christmas giveaway. Shout out to whoever gave you that. Great. Um, but anyways. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but anyways, got some. Storm, brim, bass, crappie, whatever you need. There's, it's a bait. Whatever you need. Really they might even work for trout, because trout would probably like them too. Let me see if it says it. No, it doesn't say trout, but I asked my mom and dad, they said it might work for it. Fishing favorites, hard bait. These are good. That is good. That's good that's, for a that's good crappie or a brim. I have one at the house, and I've caught at least 30 br uh, um, crappie off of it. Yeah, brim, catfish maybe, I know for sure, bass. Really just catch everything with these. Um, now, we got some of these um, things. I can demonstrate real quick. Quick. I can demonstrate really quick how these things work. I gotta go fill the bathroom with you. Yeah. And see you Here's until that. Is. Here's how you put it on. Uh, this is the lure. Do not put it on with the lure. Because it will not work. It's like, mom, go ahead. Oh, no, no, you don't need to take that out. I don't know. You go in here. You, so, you still crack. Okay, here's how you <laughs> that was loud. You got a gassy kid behind the door. Gassy Cassidy. You better do it. Oh, right. not say it. But anyway. <laughs> Stop! Anyways, put this through that little crack. <laughs> 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 no! <laughs> this is all crack. When your brother eats it, you loop it around here. And then boom, you got your shit. <laughs> and <a> bobber. <laughs> Patrick. Patrick, you gotta stop eating bagels. Alright, you're good. Alright, so here's how it floats in the water. Without a line. Without a line, these are really good. Soap water. Yeah. 
Anyways, this part is kind of boring, but I was just going to say, please like and subscribe, and I'm actually serious. Merrilewer, if you actually want to, please, I do need a sponsor. I would love to have Merrilewer as a sponsor because their stuff is goaded.